usually eat in a day. I'm gonna make this as realistic as possible. I'm not on any special diet whatsoever. I just generally like food and I also like to take care of myself watching what i eat and at the same time enjoying it make sure i watch my portions and i make sure i eat good food that's basically how i eat <laughs> so breakfast is usually the healthiest meal of the day for me a healthy breakfast i feel like it just you know sets the mood for the day and i try not to eat rice as much as possible i just feel weird when i eat rice in the morning i just feel really heavy unless you know, I have to have a heavy breakfast that's very filling and all. So what I eat for breakfast usually revolves around toast, cereal, oatmeal, fruit. Yeah, mga ganun lang. And for today, I think I'm gonna have toast and have eggs. Oh yeah, I also eat eggs. I love eggs. My mom cooked up some bacon and egg. So maybe I'll have toast with bacon and egg and a bunch of spreads that I'm so excited to share with you guys. I have a lot of spreads in our pantry because I just love spreads and I love exploring like different types of spreads for my toast. I have four right now and I'll show you the fourth one last. Um, <laughs> these are my favorite spreads. The cashew butter by made by Maxine. You can get this at the Nova Wellness store. It's super yummy and it's also vanilla flavored so that's super yummy. I also love just plain strawberry jam. I don't really have a favorite brand. As I'm looking at the ingredients, it's not really good. <laughs> but it tastes good and I love strawberry jam with like butter, toast butter and then strawberry jam. I also am loving this. This is the Cablon Farms guava jelly. I love guava. Guava is one of my favorite fruits. I'll actually leave a link of where you can get Cablon Farms products online. I highly, highly suggest you guys try this. It's really good, especially if you love guava. And on the top tier of my spreads is this. It's actually another product of made by Maxine. This one is almond butter naman. Cinnamon vanilla. I kid you not, this tastes like cookie butter. Like a healthier cookie butter. But it tastes like cookie, like Biscoff cookie butter. Speculous. This one also I highly suggest you guys try this out it's super good and i love this as like breakfast or merienda or whatever a snack you can get this at the nova wellness store i'll leave their instagram link in the description box because they're the og the og store <laughs> the best combination especially if your strawberries are tart and then the bananas are sweet So this happened to my arm last week because I was baking a cake and then I was wearing the short ano, oven mittens instead of the long sleeve one and I burned myself <laughs> but it's healing now and I almost just burned myself again. Nice and toasty.
Whoa. Whoa. That's a lot. So for lunch, I'm gonna bake this chicken. Then I'm gonna have this broccoli and string beans. We had this last night and there's a lot of leftovers, so I'm gonna eat that. Nala! Hi! What? You have to eat also? She just woke up. I saw a comment in the last vlog. He was saying that Nala was quiet for a dachshund because you know how dachshunds are super playful. She's super playful. The mga clips lang na include ko, she's behave like now because she just woke up. But she's really a ball of energy. <laughs> Hui! Ngayon lang wala siya sa mood kasi kakagising niya lang. Pero yeah, she's a ball of energy and typical hot dog, you know. Oh! Rice, veggies, chicken. Ni naman siya nasunog. I like it like that. <laughs> and then I have a side of kimchi because I always like kimchi. So yeah. Bash kimo kisimida! That chicken is good. And I guess since I'm on here, I want to talk about my relationship with food. I actually got myself into a really unhealthy relationship with food back in 2015, even before I was in college. I got sent to the ER for that because I wasn't like eating like you know bad stuff. I was just eating like healthy food that time. And one day we were um, going to watch a movie, so we watched a movie with my sister and my mom. Me and my sister we got Potato Corner. It was like a cheat day for me that time and you know how fries are like oily I had like an acid attack I had to be sent to the ER because it was so painful like personally me I have really high pain tolerance and the fact that I kind of like gave up on myself and I was like please take me to the hospital it was really bad so after that I kind of like just let loose and basically I just hear myself out if I want to eat something I eat it at the same time, I watch like how often I eat it and like how much I eat of it. And I also love vegetables. A meal isn't a meal without a side of veggies. I'm like the total foodie. That's why I'm so excited to travel again. So I already imagine myself going to another country and just trying out their food. Like yung mga markets, still doon, you know. I'm really a type of person that's like game to try anything, honestly. Dinner, I'm gonna be cooking for my family. I'm gonna cook Japanese curry. Yeah. I got you some gyop. I'm gonna use this for my beef curry.
<laughs> yes. Mm, look, look, look. Whoa. let me know your thoughts in the comments below i do read them and i just want to say i appreciate everyone thanks guys for being here with me and thank you so much for watching my vlog and i'll see you in the next one bye